I decided to set up the Makeup School um, a few years ago. Really the reasons why I wanted to open up the Makeup School is because I felt the training was needed to work on a film ultimately wasn't being given and so I just kept notes over the period of a couple of years of things that I felt that people needed to know to be like the ultimate trainee on a film. Um, you know things they weren't I felt being taught properly, dirtying down scripts, you know, what it's actually like working out on set from five in the morning till nine at night and what you're kind of expected to be a, as a trainee on films. I mean, we do, we do try to get everybody out on set a couple of times at least. Just so they know where to stand and where not to stand and what to say and what not to say and what to wear, you know. It, it kind of brings the whole thing a bit to life. But then, you know, in all fairness, I think also when they're here, if I'm in here prepping, you know, the actors come in here to, to get set up for films anyway. So, you know, I mean, they, 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 they are literally seeing the film being prepped properly. The last two weeks in boot camp is, is ultimately when we're trying to get everybody to work with a little bit more pressure. You know, they have to get their makeups done in 40 minutes and we work it as a crowd room situation. We've got a really, really good industry in England at the moment. The film industry is, is amazing, the technicians are really good. And I was very proud last year, I think a lot of the big films um, that were going on had an, the, the percentage of trainees, the highest percentage was the CBMA trainees, which I'm very proud of.